Uh, guys, this is something that a few people have um, asked over the past few days of this. So we've got the underhook, we get up, and then the person frees this, this leg. Scott's able to free this leg. So how do we stop that? Now, I want, okay, you can, you can definitely like pinch your knees together to do this, but now I have my base is caught, so I'll never actually take him over to do that. Um, so what I want to do is I want to drive my knee really close to Scott's knee. I want to bring my hips close to his hips. I start like, almost like I'm baseball sliding out at this way. Now it's very, like if Scott wants to free that, he really has to almost fall over to, to do that, right? So when you get up from your underhook swing, yeah, see the way my hips turn? They face outwards like this, okay? Not here. If I'm actually facing Scott, it's very easy for him to free that leg and get it away. Sorry. It puts pressure into him because I'm still like driving with my hips. I'm sliding my knee kind of forward and just got straight the legs. Yes, good. It's very difficult for me to. They always can if they want, but for me to free it now, I basically have to give my back because it's not far. I have to basically do this. Yeah. 